We've partnered with our friends at Xbox to bring you exclusive Minecraft themed content so you can take your gaming channel to the next level. Hey everyone, Paige here with ClipChamp and in this video I'll show you how you can use our new Minecraft themed gaming templates and stickers in ClipChamp. Start by logging into ClipChamp or sign up for free. Next you'll be taken inside the editor. I'll start by showing you how to access and edit our free Minecraft templates followed by how to access our Minecraft stickers. So firstly, to access the Minecraft templates, navigate over to the toolbar on the left and click into the templates tab. Now scroll down and find the Minecraft template collection. Inside this collection, there are a range of different matching Minecraft themed intro and outro templates. Simply hover your cursor over the template for a preview of what it looks like. You can see which is an intro or an outro by the title of the template here. When you found the one that you want to use, you'll click on the green plus button here to add the template into your timeline. These templates are designed so you won't have to make many changes. They'll all have preset transitions, effects, stickers, and music. So all you'll need to do is update the text to your own channel name. Firstly, to change the text to your own channel name, in your timeline, you'll see the two text bars here. Click on the top text bar and it will highlight in green so that you know which one you've selected. Now navigate into the stage and hit the edit text button. Type in the first part of your channel name. Now you'll do the same for the second text bar by clicking on it in the timeline and then back up in the stage, just click on the edit text button and adjust the text. Now, if you do need to edit the size or the placement of the text, you can do this for both text bars at the same time. Hold the shift key on your keyboard and click on both of those text bars in the timeline. They will both be highlighted in green. Now to resize, drag the corners either in or out to make that text bigger or smaller. You can then move that text anywhere around the stage and place it wherever you'd like on the screen. Do this until you're happy with the look of your intro video. Now, if you're wanting to use the matching outro Minecraft template, just create a new video project and follow the same steps by jumping into the template tab and adding it in. Or you can just jump into the template tab in this project and add in the matching outro template to your timeline. Once you're happy with your Minecraft template, you'll export it to your device by navigating up to the export button selecting your video quality, and once that export is complete, a copy of the video will automatically save to your device. You can also upload your video straight to one of our integrations on the left of the export page here. Next, jumping into how to add the Minecraft stickers to your video, you'll start by importing your video. Navigate over to the Import Media button, select the asset and hit Open. You can also import your media using our Xbox integration by clicking the drop down arrow here, clicking into the Xbox integration button, and then following the prompts. The assets will be accessible in the media tab here. Now add your video into the timeline by dragging and dropping it in like this. You'll then jump over to the toolbar and click into the content library tab. Select the drop down arrow of the visuals tab and then click into stickers. Now just scroll through all of the collections until you find the Minecraft stickers collection. This houses all of our free Minecraft stickers. When you found the sticker you want to use, simply drag and drop it into your timeline, placing it on top of your video asset. Now just resize the asset in the stage by dragging the corners in or out to make it bigger or smaller. Then move it around and place it anywhere you'd like on the screen until you're happy. If you do want to make the sticker appear throughout your whole video, make sure the sticker asset is the same length as your video asset by dragging the end handle in the timeline all the way to the right until it meets the end of your video. Now, if you want more stickers in your video, you can add as many as you like. Just follow the same steps as before by dragging and dropping them into the timeline, changing the size and the duration. Then, once you're happy with your video and all of your edits are complete, export it by following the same exporting steps as before. And that's how you can use our new Minecraft themed gaming templates and stickers in ClipChamp. 
If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for our weekly how-to videos.